Perfect. Can you hear me okay? And can you see me? Oh, can you see me? Perfect. Okay. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. How's it going, guys? Good, good afternoon, all right? Good afternoon, good afternoon. So, how, how many um, how many kids do we have there? There's nine boys. Nine boys, okay. Perfect. Now, I just want to do something real quick. Um, screen record. Nice. And today's, today's Wednesday, right? Perfect. Record. And now we're all set to go. All right, now we're all set. What's up, everyone? So that's one, two, nine boys. And how's it? Are you eating right now? Yes. Okay. Um, can they also, do they have access? Do you have pen and paper? I got it. How's it going, everyone? My name is Amadeus. And I, I lived in Appleton, Wisconsin, which is, has anyone, can you raise your hand if you've ever lived in Appleton before? I mean, sorry, have you, have you ever been to Appleton? It's a small, small city, isn't it? What about, um, has anyone been to, let's say, Grand Rapids? That's Michigan. So, what, what, what's another place? Um, Madison. Has anyone been to Madison before? Madison? Nice. Oh, what, a, what about Oshkosh? Yeah, Oshkosh? Has anyone ever been out of, has anyone been out of Wisconsin? Has anyone ever been to Chicago? Couple, couple. Oh, okay. Chicago. Can you tell me, like, what, was you, what did you do in Chicago? Uh, I went to see my cousin. Uh. And, yeah. Yep, you went to see your cousin, right? And what about you, Dave? Yeah. This, what did you do in Chicago? Uh, Mr. Sydney, I'm going to ask for you to repeat because I can't really hear. He said he went to um, hang out with family. They grilled out. Uh, his big brother would beat him up. And, uh, <laughs> big brother would beat him. Big brother would beat you up. What? All right. So, and I'm going to ask: Has anyone ever been? This is the last question here. Has anyone ever been out of the country? Ooh. <laughs> Oh, oh, whoa, 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 out of the country. Out of the country? Out of the wow, out of the United States. So, has anyone, okay. So. Zenith is going to Europe. Oh, oh when, are you, when are you going? I'm going to Orlando. Yeah, that's in the country. When are you going to Europe? Uh, end of this year. End of, end of this year. End of this year. And do you know where in Europe? Because Europe is a big continent. We have a great diverse group here, so. So guys, I just wanted to, to know more about you guys and introduce myself to you guys. So me, I'm just going to tell you about myself for like two minutes. I know you're eating. So my name is Amadeus. Uh, I'm actually from New York. Has anyone been to New York? No? Yes? Maybe? Yeah. Yeah, so I'm actually from New York. And I've been to... Oh, you've been there. So I've, I lived in Wisconsin for three years. And I went to high school in Appleton East. You probably don't know that. After Wisconsin, I lived in Japan for one year. And that's where I learned how to speak Japanese. After Japan, is now I'm, I'm living in London. And so next year, I actually be going to China. So I know I've been going all over the place. But there's one consistent thing there, and that's what I want to teach you guys today. So first off, so is everyone pretty much done eating? Can you just raise your hand if you're, if you're, a bit, if you're done eating? Just so I know. Does everyone have a paper? Yes. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Now... Can you take your paper and can you fold? Oh, I'll, I'll show you guys. All right. You have your paper right here. Can you fold it in half? Okay. And just rip it. Then just rip it up. So. Uh. Basically, just rip your paper. Say you have two two papers, okay? Say you have two. Yeah. So you have you have two papers. Nice, nice, clean cuts. Nice, clean cuts. 
I know, I know it's not, it's not all clean. Mine is not that clean myself, you know. So, so I want you to put one paper down and hold one paper, okay? You have one paper, right? So hold your paper up, hold your paper up. Once you're done, hold your paper. Let me know who's first. Let me know who's first. Who's going to be first to put their paper up? Oh, I see. Oh, what we have? Nice, nice. Uh oh, fantastic. Fantastic. Perfect. Okay, that's great. I see you. That's perfect. That's perfect. Perfect. All right. So on this paper, I want you to write down. Okay. Today's Wednesday. Okay. I want you to write down what you're going to do this weekend. So just write down this weekend. This weekend I'm going to go, I'm going to go with my family, or this week I'm going to, I just want to know what you're going to do this weekend, okay? I'll give you about two or three minutes. Don't worry, I'll give, I'll give you some time. Um, I'm going to think about it as well. Let me just go on my calendar. <laughs> Everyone's all done. Everyone's all done. Fantastic. Does anyone, re does anyone want to read out what they want to do this weekend? How about we start off with you? How about we start off with you? How about we start off with you? Um, my bike and play games with my cousin. Riding your bikes, play games. Yep, riding your bikes, play games with your cousin. Fantastic. So, I want you guys to do another exercise. So... Take that paper, you have a paper, right? Right? Flip it over, so now this is blank. Flip it on the other side, okay? Flip it over and write down, write down what you want to do after college. After college. Okay, so I just muted myself, right? So um, what I'm doing is I have them write down what they're doing this weekend. And after they write down what they've done this weekend, I've asked them what they want to do after college. So if you get what I'm doing here, I'm giving, I'm giving them a parallel of what they're doing in two days versus what they want to be doing. I'll show you more about it. Perfect. Good. So everyone is done. Perfect. Fantastic. Now, who wants to read them out loud? Actually, not everyone is going to read this one. So last time I started on the, on the right side of the room. This time I'm gonna this time I'm gonna start on the left side of the room. So yeah. so everyone say what they want it to be on this side of the paper, right? So if you flip if you flip over that side of the paper where I said what you're going to do this weekend, you don't say this out loud, but is what you're doing this weekend, is that, going to help, is that going to help you out be the person you want to be? Think about it. Don't, don't say it. Just, just, read, just read what you're going to do this weekend and read what, you're going to, what you want to be when you grow up. Does it match? Yeah, so right now I just had them write down five things that they feel like they should be doing based off what they wrote down on the piece of paper. So now we're going to see how this goes. Guess what? I got I to gotta, I gotta just jump in for one second. Yep. So, so everyone who wants to be a professional basketball player or a football Thank you. 
And so what the teacher just said right now is that the consistency of what I just said was that you have to go out to college first. So he brought that up. I didn't really think about that, but. Guys, I guess what I want to end on, is, in this no, on this note is that you have people that's my age or your teacher's age who don't know what, the, what they want to be when they grow up and they don't know what they should be doing. So I want to tell you guys about dreams, right? Has, how many of you guys had a dream within the past, say, week? Everyone, right? Right? And, do you, right? and has anyone had a dream when they was running away from a bad guy? They was running away, right? And then you suddenly realize, like, wait, wait, I'm in a dream. I can do whatever I want. Does any, has anyone had that feeling before? They're running away, they're running, and it's, wait, wait, wait. I'm in a dream. I can do whatever I want. And, you know, that's, that's exactly, you know, what life is, exactly when you know what you want to do. It's that moment you say, wait, I can do whatever I want. I can be whatever I want to be. Now it's just, you're young. Every day you start taking those steps. You start writing down what you're going to be doing during the weekend, what you're going to do tomorrow, what you're going to do the day after. And you keep on trying to be that person who you want to be. So if you want to be basketball players, who said basketball? Who said basketball? And you should be playing basketball five, six, seven days a week. Boxer, boxing five, six, seven days a week. Soccer player, same thing. Coast Guard, you should be learning about the seas and the ocean. You know, you should be asking questions to your teachers about the Navy. So um, whatever you want to be, it's not who do you want to be when you grow up. I want everyone to, to, to take this down. Okay? Has, every, has anyone been asked, who do you want to be when you grow up? Has anyone been asked that question before? Who has been asked, who do you want to be when you grow up? Has anyone asked, been asked that question? Well, next time someone asks you, listen up, listen up, this is important. This is important. The next time someone asks you, who do you want to be when you grow up? You know, you, you just hold your chest and say, you know what? I'm already that person. That's it. Because growing up, grow, that, that time when you grow up, it's who knows that, that exact day when you grow up. I'm 19. I'm not grown up. Someone would say I'm someone who's dirty is not grown up. So it's about growing up. The question is, who do you want to become as you're growing up? That's the question, guys. So you're young. You have the life all ahead of you. And just start tackling every single day to those dreams. And I guarantee you, you'll be that football player. You'll be that basketball player. You'll be that Coast Guard. You'll be that boxer. You'll be whatever you want to be. Just make sure that what you're doing this weekend is exactly what that person will be doing. And that's all I have to say, guys. Thank you so much. What's up, everyone? It's Amadeus Frazier. And just finished speaking to these kids. Um, cool experience, you know, being able to speak to these um Young minds, it's actually kind of a blessing in a sense, you know. So um, it was a bit difficult because they're younger; they can't really consume information as we can as adults. Me and you watching, but it was a good experience. I got them to engage in an exercise. So this is a simple exercise, right? But this is how you know you're on track with whatever you want to achieve, right? I said, okay, write down what you're doing this weekend on one side, and then write down what you want to do after you graduate from college. Simple. If these two don't match up, then you're doing the wrong things. And that's what you can be doing. You can even ask yourself that right now. What are you doing this weekend? And who do you plan, you know, to become? You know, do, do they match up? So, so I did a little exercise with them and whatnot. And it was, it was a cool experience. I mean, I, I appreciate it. Thanks to Mr. Williams of Sydney who, um, who um, connected us, connected me to the kids and the experience. It was very cool. Um, now, thank you for watching this video as well. If you're watching the video straight through, it was a pretty long video, I'm assuming. If you watch this to this point, then thank you. Appreciate that. You know, hopefully you've learned something, even though I had to dumb down my, uh, my articulation a little bit. But now, in all the sense, um, to be in this seat and give my wisdom and what I've learned. I'm still young myself. I'm still a kid. To be able to, you know, give my wisdom to someone else, it's, it's a real blessing, you know, so... I guess with 
what you guys can take from this besides little exercises that you know giving giving yourself your knowledge being a person of service is the most gratifying feeling you can, you can get and you know, I feel really good I feel really good inside you know so really good day but can't become complacent gonna head back because I'm in my university right now I'm gonna head back to the library um, edit some more videos get you guys watching these, these next videos that's gonna be really cool but just to stay on topic for today very good experience you know having them learn from me is beyond my dreams you know so thank you guys for watching always subscribe so you can get content like this on a day-to-day -day basis because I'm just I'm just committed to you know helping you guys get to those dreams because everyone wants to go somewhere but it's a journey of how to get there if people don't really know. So I'm going to help you guys get to those dreams. Subscribe to this channel. I'm Adidas Fraser, and peace out.